WTFNN. Headline news update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 10 a.m. Eastern time on Tuesday, 30 minutes into the trading day. And we got markets starting off to the negative side. Dow Jones, negative 54 points right now, trading 26,673. S&P's negative by six, trading at 29.39. We get the Russell trading negative two points at 15.27, and the NASDAQ negative 22, or about three-tenths percent, trading at 79.82. Quite a little sell-off on the opening bell. We'll start things off. Let's jump over to the futures markets. We'll start it off with the Dow. So I was on here at 9 o'clock. Things looked pretty rosy as the market had bounced off of that low we had last night at about 1 a.m. Eastern time, but we reached the opening bell, and you see the Dow trade from 26.766, down about 100 points, 26,000. We'll get the low 668 at about 20 minutes ago and the Dow bouncing around right under 26,700. S&P is much the same. These are five minute bars we're looking at. Quite an extension right after 930. We traded from about 2952 right ahead of that open down to a low 2940. S&P is trading 2945. NASDAQ 100 sells off a bit as well from 77.54. We dipped to a low 77.14, currently trading 77.28. Crude oil with some volatility, back above $58, trading at $58.22. Gold catching quite a bit overnight. At about midnight, we climb above $14.40, $14.42 in the price of August gold, currently trading $14.35. And euro US dollar right under that $114 price point. You got euro trading $113.94. In terms of what else you have happening across the market, Amazon Prime Day. I would love to be in the room when they say, how do we make Prime Day even bigger? We'll say we'll make it two days, July 15th and 16th. Lennar are with their earnings as they beat as lower mortgage rates boots, boosts excuse me, home sales to jump over to Lennar, L-E-N. Take a look. Up about 2% off of that high we had on that initial spike to 54.70. Amazon. Basically flat today at 1910. And the other big news out there is quite a merger as you as Abby looking to buy Humira with $63 billion for Algen. Pretty remarkable deal there. Stay tuned, folks. Come back at 10 o'clock with Tom. Of course, we got Fast Market, TD Ameritrade, Thinkorswim, Kevin Hicks and the team at 11. Basil Chapman, Steve Rhodes, Dave White, Tom O'Brien, all this afternoon. Stay tuned, folks. Have a great Tuesday.